Here with senior women's point guard Janelle Perez on the eve of senior night uh, here against SFA and Prather Coliseum. Pat Prather, Orange Owl, a whole lot of stuff surrounding this. Janelle, uh, I know we talked about it a couple weeks ago. You're a senior, you're going to play your last uh, home game here. How surreal is that? Um, I was just talking about it earlier, you know, and it's crazy. I came in as a freshman, I was just like new to everything, and now being here as a senior, it's just incredible how um, from when I started to getting here, you know, and I guess it, it, it hasn't really hit me all that much yet because we have a few games after this, but um, just being playing here for the last time in an environment that's been really good and amazing is just, it's sad, but it's also good. It's a good feeling. And, you know, I wouldn't, I wouldn't want to play anywhere else but here, you know, we have some of the best fans, and I'm just thankful for being able to play here. What has this journey been like for you? Uh, it's been pretty crazy. You know, I've, we've had good moments, bad moments, you know, and it, it's all made me who I am now, you know, and it's, it's been a, a blessing to be able to play here for Coach Scott and Coach Brooke, you know, and different teammates that I've had every year. and. The journey's been a good one, but there's been tough times, you know, where I've had to learn from it and grow, and it's, this journey's helped me a lot. It's helped me realize a lot of things. It's a, uh, pretty safe to say you've grown alongside this program. Uh, I mean, Coach tells the story. You said three words when you were Christian visit. Thank you, Coach. Yeah. And here you are now. You, you've been in, on the big stage at Tennessee and at Baylor interacting with media. What's your favorite memory of the almost four years you've been here now? Uh, I would say my favorite memory is probably my sophomore year when we first won our, uh, the, South, the Southland Conference Tournament and being able, like, having the confetti, confetti fall, you know. As a, as a little girl, you always look at teams in, uh, that win the national championship and you see that, the confetti and cutting down of the nets and the coaches talking about that, players talking. And just to be a part of something like that was probably – the best feeling I've had, I've ever had, and being sharing that with a teammate, and my teammates, and my family, and my coaches is just the best, the best feeling. Now, your parents and your family made the ten-hour drive last year. They're going to be here tomorrow night. Mm -hmm. How do you control your emotions? You, you play with such a poker face anyway that it seems like you're able to internalize those. How are you going to do that for the last time here at Fraser? Yeah, it's going to be hard, you know. Um, my family's gonna be here, you know, and they've been a big part of my journey, you know. Um, they've supported me through everything I've ever wanted to do, and just ex experiencing that's gonna have a little bit of emotion, but um, I know that it's we still have business to take care of, and you know, after the game is a whole different story, so I'm just gonna stay focused on the game, and then afterwards, you know, uh, enjoying the time I have with my family being here, you know, and that's what it's all about, is enjoying every moment, and Coach has been, telling us that every moment counts and we're enjoying the we're enjoying it right now and that's just how it's going to continue to be and just take care of business when you talked about your family you played alongside jackie for two years uh earlier this month the game that started the, the five game winning streak you're on you had the first perez to perez assist what was that like and where does that stand on your memories here that's that's a, actually a pretty good memory you know uh being able to play with my sister has been what I've been wanting to do you know we went to different high school so we never got the opportunity to but her being here just makes everything so much better and especially taking the court with her you know she understands my game a little bit more than um, other uh, players do because she's seen me and she's we played a city league together but actually school wise you know she understands and she knows what she has to do and that assist that I gave her and she was able to knock it down. It was just, if it, it was so great in that moment. I was so excited. I probably cheered for her more than I've ever cheered for myself for making a shot. And it's just those moments that you live for, you know, and honestly, that was just a great, great moment right there. And she, she's so, uh, she gets shy and stuff and nervous, but like, I'm so proud of her too. And the person she's becoming as well. What was your, your reaction to your reaction when you saw it on film? Because I know the bench went crazy, but... I, I guess I didn't realize how happy I got. You know, I was just like, wow, like, I'd never celebrate. And in that moment, like, I saw myself and it was just... I was, like, chasing down to, like, 
like hug her, you know, and she was just like, <laughs> she didn't know what to do, but I was just so happy. I was so happy for her. Thanks, Susan. Mm -hmm.